Hello there and welcome! In this video, we will show you how to work with Customer Portal. To get started, go to our main page, where you can find Customer Portal over here. You have to log in into this page using your login details, which will be provided to you by our support. So, this is your personal page. Here you can see your products and the type of the solution that you have, number of users and until when you have your updates paid for. And over here you can download your package. Before you download it, you have to agree to the installation terms and then click on the download stable package. In a few seconds it will start downloading. You can see the download over here. And over here you can see some important information. And as you can see the package has successfully downloaded. Here you have your support level which you can always change. So if you would like to get quicker and more advanced support, you can choose advanced or professional level and here you can choose your payment method. Now let's uh, go back. Below you can see all the plugins that you currently have. So here you have the core, some finance plugins and some more advanced plugins. And here you can also purchase new plugins. So for example, if you want to buy resource management plugin, I will click on the cart and it will be added to my order. Let's go back, see what else we have here. Or well, here we have the billing information, which you can edit, and here you can change the password. Just put in your old password and the new one. Now on the side menu you can see help desk. Here you can see the tickets which were created by you and in which state they are currently are. And over here you can see the tickets that were assigned to you. Here you can also create new support tickets just put subject, priority, current behavior and the desired behavior. You can also add URL and attach some documents or images and then just click submit support ticket. Once you create it, it will appear in the tickets created by me in section new. Then if you open one of the tickets, you can see what is happening there. Here you can see all the updates from the support and the attachments. Here you can also update the ticket and close it. Now over here you can also see a purchase service hour page. You will need this if you have some feature request. So our support workers will tell you how many hours it will take to develop a certain feature. So the client just needs to select the quantity over here at the top and you can see the total price. The bill confirmation is pre-filled from your profile, so here you can just select the payment method and submit your order. Then just contact the support that you paid and that's it. In the side menu you can also find your invoices which includes invoices for all your purchases. We don't have any invoices in this testing account, but here you will see the list of invoices. Now, if you would like to see the changelog, you have to go to our FAQ section. And here you can see changelog slash roadmap menu item. And here you can see each version, you can open it and see all the bugs and all the change requests, what is it about and their statuses. On the main page on the customer portal, you can see some direct links to things like tutorials and documentation. And that's pretty much it. This was a quick overview of customer portal. Thank you for watching and good luck.